But Come speaking on. about DeRozan, Lowry. though, we got some news saying that the Lakers are inter- interested in trading for DeMar DeRozan, packaging away Danny Green and Kyle Kuzma. What um, do you guys think? I mean, dude, honestly, he's been a little bit over the hill. He didn't do play too well at the Spurs these past few years, I feel like. I don't know. I mean, you couldn't even get him to an eighth seed. Like, he couldn't lead them to an eighth seed. But I like that he's a hometown kid, and he's better than Kuzma, and I think he would fit our roster pretty I well. Completely and I would disagree want, with that. And I yeah. would want a, um, like, or I would hope for, I guess, like a comeback season from him. But, dude, it's been a few years over there. How long has he been in San Antonio for? What, two at least years. two? Yeah, yeah, two years. I want to yeah. hear your take, then. DeRozan, the, the, the uh... He's a, he's a good player. I would label him a B-type player. He's not an A. star. No, I think he's he maybe even a, like C a C plus. C plus. Yeah. Maybe even a C yeah. plus. C plus. I do not think he's a good fit for this team. Uh, offensive or defensive or both? Uh, I guess offensively I'm looking at it because here's the deal. If you look at the Lakers right now, two players that are going to say no matter what are LeBron and AD. Right. And how does LeBron thrive with all his championship teams? Shooters. Shooters. And on top of that, he loves to have playmakers. Playing with him, right? So he wants to have playmakers on the floor, so he doesn't have to always have to pass and, and do all the hard hard thinking. He does. He wants players that he can just throw it to, so that they can shoot. And then now with AD and having bigs that can shoot, like AD and Dwight can dominate the paint, like you know, with his toughness. De, DeRozan does not fit that. Why? He shoots, I it believe, twenty five to twenty six percent from three. Yeah, right. That's okay. terrible. Okay, yeah. and uh, if you notice how uh, DeRozan plays. He likes to uh, not necessarily ISO, but he likes to take the ball up, dribble, dribble, jump shot, and he'll probably yeah. make it. Yeah, he probably will ball, make right, it. Right. But that's not that doesn't fit what we do, right? right. We already what about know off the bench though. How you feel about that's that? That's what I was going to say. Will he accept that role? I don't think he will. And, are you, and he's I making twenty seven million. He's making twenty seven uh, million. We're going to take a cut. Oh wait, nah. So we have to. T- how, we have does to trade Kuzma the, how does that work Danny with the Green. trade? Ca- oh, Danny yeah. Green and Kuzma. So we we, would, would, like, we pick up. up just like low end players after and that. And it doesn't. Yeah. And it does. Or yeah, exactly. Pay, That's my end. other point. And it doesn't matter really because it's only one year. I believe in twenty twenty two he's a free agent. So it's not like it's forever. Right. But exactly, if we take DeRozan, that's it. He's and like our third star. He's he's our third star, and and we're basically saying we're gonna play the way we played last year with DeRozan. I don't believe that. Mm, nah. That's not gonna happen. There's only one way I will be okay with bringing DeRozan if we had to get rid of Danny Green and Kuzma. That's if LeBron plays point, KCP is playing uh, second right, uh, next to us because that that will put a three point bomber on the floor, and we get Ibaka. Iblaka. Iblaka. If, and that, and we'll talk about that later. But he shoots, uh, I looked it up earlier, almost 39% from three. Yeah. So if we, have, career highs. if we have four three-point bombers on the floor, because LeBron can shoot it, uh, we know AD can shoot it, right. and we put DeRozan in, then fine. I'm fine with that. But I don't think all that's going to happen. Iblaka's a starter, straight up. I like Yeah, yeah. The, put him with AD, no one's getting in the paint. But oh, when it comes to DeRozan, uh, I don't like the fit. I, I don't. I don't like the move. How do you if, feel about him being from LA, though? Does that sway you anyway? Right. Oh, I mean, all? he's a native. Yeah, of course. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I'm not going to be mad. That's my main reason. I'm like, I want to bring him back. Too. I'm not going to be mad if DeRozan comes here. But do I? Do I think that's the best move we can make? No. no I, the main issue is the money. It seems like, man. Is but it's that, only yeah. a year. It's only yeah. a year. It's going to go away. But it's yeah. not even that. It's the fit. And so we won the we won the chip. So we have to continue to do what we were doing last year. If you bring DeRozan, that's not what's going to happen. We, uh, unless we bring, oh, you're okay with bringing and, him off the bench, though. But you're, you're will he accept that. that role? I don't know. Yeah. And here's the thing. In his hometown. I feel like, like DeRozan damn. coming here and us doing that to him where we make him think about it. He's on a contract year, right? He's going right. to need another contract. He's right. going to be 32 years old. Like, do do you think he wants to accept that role? I don't believe so. And uh, it might be yet. dramatic. It was, yeah. It might be drama because it's not like DeRozan is just no. going to bow down. Yes, he is. He's going to no, bow down. No, he's from Compton, King. man. I don't he's care. He's from Compton. He's not oh just going to like, oh, the, nah. <laughs> nah. That boy was crying when Toronto nah. traded him. He was like, Lowry, please don't don't separate <laughs> yeah, us, please. And, yeah, he was and, crying. And when Kawhi won it, it was even worse. But yeah. yeah. And that's my yeah. thing. I'm going to give you my take. He's been bowed down. Yeah, he's been bowed down <laughs> to to the king. Think about how many times then, LeBron yes. has dominated the East and the Raptors. I think yeah, DeRozan, hold up. this now is I why can't. I don't think he's a good fit because I think DeRozan is going to fall down under pressure. It's like, damn, LeBron's my king. Like, <laughs> my father. He's been he's dominating. Father. For, yes, like pressure's yeah. too high on me right now. I don't know. Not in San know. Antonio. I don't know about that. He's going to be the third player if he were to join. Yeah. But, but I don't like the fit. I do have his stats pulled up right here on the on the screen. Oh, here we go. Last season, he didn't play that bad. Look, 22 points, five assists. That's a career high. That's nice. Five rebounds. That three-point percentage is the scariest thing, but his field goal is 
54, like, he's pretty efficient from the two. He's that's what, what like a do, big. What those stats tell me is that he is a mid-range jump shooter. Yes. Yeah. That's not what yes. we, first of all, that's not how we won the chip right. this past summer, and that's not how we're, we we play. I say we fill it out. I feel like he's a good name, like, because yes. he was an all-star. That's all it is. It's a yeah. nice name. Yeah. I say we play it out because, realistically, Danny Green and Kuzan are our only trade options. I say we. We feel like the thing. I'm always the type, like, let's run it back. We pretty much ran through the playoffs. If that's all we have available, let's make the move. Right. But it's too early, and I, that's not the best move we can make right now. Yeah. Yeah, I, I agree with you. But um, going back, you guys said that we should bring in Ibaka. I was hearing yes. rumors. That's. Do you think he would pay a pay cut, though? To like? Well, that's what I had read, that right. he uh, wants to win. But I also that's heard, what I like uh, to hear. I also mm-hmm. heard uh, that from uh, Ganelari. Mm-hmm. Is that pronounced that right? If we're going to pick him up. Yeah. So I, I like the idea of having another big, but here's the thing I keep forgetting DeMarcus Cousins. DeMarcus Cousins. Mm-hmm. But low key, I would and rather we have would him. Get, I don't believe in him. But we would get DeMarcus Cousins. Cousins at, well, okay. Let me let me wind it back. Mm-hmm. DeMarcus Cousins is going to come, come back. I don't know what he's going to be, but he's going to come in cheap. Very, very right. cheap. Minimum dollars, like whatever. Is it worth getting that? And. Because Ibaka is going to be expensive, I would assume that that's going to take up most of our cap. And I we're going to—he's worth it though. Like imagine Ibaka. Yeah. Hold on. Imagine Ibaka in DeRozan. There, they have a friendship, I believe. No, um, no? they played in Toronto. Oh, together, they played right? in Toronto. Okay. For a year, they yeah. probably have some sort of fr- uh, some. They're sort cool. Of they know each other. Yeah. What if they're like coming together? Like, all right, let's just make this happen. But that's we'll, what I'm we'll saying. Get the contracts done because that's the only boom. way I uh-huh. see DeRozan. Deal. I like the DeRozan deal if Ibaka comes, and even Ibaka mm-hmm. alone, I like it. Yes, even Ibaka, Ibaka alone, I like sure it. Yeah. starter because we'll put him at right the center. Away. AD yeah. will play power forward, which well, he likes to play. Yep. We have to keep AD happy. Yep, and and we have LeBron, of course. So that's the way I see it right now. Ibaka to me is probably. My 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 the one signing I want to to the Lakers like the that, most desire that, yeah. that locks us the in, most bro. realistic yeah. signing I want the Lakers that to locks them us or um, Dino Gallinari is that how you say Danilo, Ga- Danilo, Danilo Gallinari, Gallinari. Yeah. I, I like him I too though Italian. I like him too he could get his he own get hot and yeah. he's also three if he bonus. wants to win him he block to take the minimum contracts and then we'll <laughs> throw through. in DeRozan kick out Danny Green Kuzma and because this is what happened with David West uh, when he went to the Warriors that's true he took a big pay cut because he wanted a ring right yep. so this could be the case with Ibaka and this is our turn Lari. so yep hopefully that is the case but I, I like those moves I yeah. do like Ibaka I do like Ibaka Gallinari what do you guys think of like KCP and Avery Bradley moving forward so I, we well, need Avery Bradley yeah. uh, that's gonna be a big deal because I, I feel like we should keep him well, it's not our choice. He has an opt in or an opt out. He well, he, he makes it that he makes that decision. Uh-huh. Uh, he, uh, today it was announced that he switched agents, so we don't know what his mentality is. It might be, you know, I want that next contract. I don't know. Um, He's like, I'm a super Bowl, or I'm a, a finals uh, champion. He's like, I need to get paid. Uh, <laughs> it's time to cash quote out. Quote unquote champion. I don't know. Yeah. But but yeah. So so that's I don't know. That's I think that's critical that he opts in for us. Uh, from a GM perspective, if he right. opts out, that's going to be a problem. And that's going to, if he opts out, mm-hmm. that's just going to give more leverage to KCP to say, you don't got nothing. You need to sign me. You mm-hmm. need to give me this big contract. We already paid him like so much money. I feel mm-hmm. like KCP already got and, paid. And he's clutch. Uh, Rich Paul, we know how he can be. Yeah. So, yeah. so I think that's kind of a domino effect. Yeah. Like, like that. Yeah. You know, if Avery Bradley opts in, we could probably keep KCP because, you know, I mean, KCP's not dumb. He knows like our, we can't just give him everything, right? We have right. other players. Well, he's so. just trying to cash out on the fucking ring, bro. Yeah. Really? He already, like you said, they got overpaid. They all are, though. Rondo's trying to yeah. cash out. They all are, yeah. KCP. Yeah. Kuzma wants a sizable deal, right? That's Come the whole thing right now. <laughs> they all want that, right? That Kuzma. So it's like, it's kind of, it's interesting how it's playing out. You would think normally when you win a chip, mm-hmm. everyone wants to come back. But no. everyone just cares about they the money right cash now. Out. In my eyes, the players who do deserve that, like, extra money is just Rondo and Dwight Howard. Dwight, I feel yeah. like those are the two that, especially Dwight, he pretty much got paid, like. He's solid. Like. Yeah, like weekly. He was like a bi-weekly player. Like, yeah, hey, every two weeks we're paying you. Yeah, mm. yeah. So I feel like if uh, KCP, he already stole. Like, it's gonna be an interesting offseason. I, I don't know. The Lakers team might look a lot different. I'm kind of right. hoping it does though. Like, as long as Giannis doesn't get like traded, there's no way he'll get traded this offseason, right? No, no. Nah. So as long he as asks, that doesn't unless he happen, asks for it. 
Yeah. I think I, I like the Lakers will be sure locked in favorites again because he's like the big free agent that would make us and like, I will say uh, right, right. swing the odds. And I do like, want to say this about wise. about KCP. I like KCP. I think he proved himself in the finals. Yeah, he made very critical three point shots. So it's not like I don't want to pay him. You know, let's pay him fair. Yeah, but for him to walk like we paid him, I think one year nineteen million a couple years ago. Right, then we gave him a two year before that. It was a whole bunch of good contracts, he yeah. and he was playing. Money. He was playing bad, you know. So I would, uh, I would hope that for he 80s. would like at least acknowledge yeah. that that happened, you know. Right. And um, I, I, like, I want no. him back. He's like, I want more. He's like, I ain't acknowledge. <laughs> I want to pay me over. And KCP shit. is young. He's in his twenties. Yeah, yeah. That's I think true. he's like a little older than us. He's like 27, 28, yeah. somewhere yeah. there. So that's crazy when you think about them. They're like twenty six, and we're like, fuck. Yeah, it's man. like goddamn, bro. <laughs> I'm six million. So I'm like, I could have made the on. league. Fuck, dude. I had the genetics. You probably could have. You got yeah. the hype for it. It's all good though. But you served our country. I waste my talents. No.